Hey everybody, welcome to the Yeshua Network, uh, facebook.com, Yeshua Official is the page. My name is Nathan Wheeler, owner of the page, and I just wanted to come today and invite you to join us on October 22nd for a global act of unity. People will be going out into their front yards, on their balconies of their apartments, and uh, or to the front of their businesses, the corner street of where they live, and they're going to be lighting a candle. Uh, much something that will look like this, just a candle with a tray of some sort. Uh, a cup works well as well because it also protects from the wind. So if you're in a city or a place where the wind is blowing, uh, I recommend using a cup, um, one of those clear cups. And what I did was I actually took my candle and I just burned the bottom of this tray and then I stuck the candle up through the hole and it worked out quite well. And uh, the candle gets wider towards the bottom, so it just uh, sits right on the candle naturally. The cup will do the same thing because these candles are thinner at the top and thicker at the base. So this is a reminder. The event is called Be the Light, October 22nd. The event happens at sundown wherever you are. There are no tickets. There is nowhere you need to fly to. This is not happening in a building or a gathering somewhere in the world. It is happening with you. It is happening where you are. And it happens at the moment the sun sets behind the horizon so that everybody knows at the exact same time where they are in the world. Anybody who's doing this is doing it at the same time, which is when the sun sets behind the horizon. Symbolic of the world is becoming a darker place. Uh, society and our global community as a human race is becoming more and more divided. It's becoming more and more agitated and more aggressive. Uh, we are all unhappy with the way that things are and we all want our voices to be heard, rightfully so. We all have a right to the pursuit of happiness, love and joy in this world and it is promised to those who are, uh, who are blessed with the Holy Spirit. So not to get too religiosity on you, uh, but those of us who are called the body of Christ are called to be one body, one mind. This event is not necessarily a religious thing. It's a spiritual thing. It's a symbolic thing. It's something that I prayed about. It's something that I believe that God inspired me to lead. Uh, the date was given to me, 22nd, is a special day. The number 22 in the Hebrew alphabet uh, is also the final letter of the alphabet in Hebrew, or uh, the, the letters and numbers are one and the same. And 22 is also the number for light. And since this is be the light, uh, and the idea is for us to shine in the darkness when the world is dark, that's the reason for the October 22nd date. So if you guys would be so kind to share this video, if you've gotten this video shared to your page, your email, or anything like that, chances are the person who sent it to you loves you, uh, knows that you are somebody who would also like to see unity in the world, and it costs you nothing. We're not asking for any donations. There is no performing artist. There is no great speaker. There is nothing like that. It is simply people walking out into their front yards, lighting a candle. If you visit facebook.com forward slash Yeshua official, Y-E-S-H-U-A official, you will see videos that we did where we actually did a pre-shoot of this, of us walking to um, uh, my front yard and lighting a candle with my friends and my neighbors and uh, gives you a perfect example of what to do. Very simple, nothing difficult at all, and it costs you 50 cents for a candle. So I pray that you will join us. I pray that this will actually be a thing that will give you hope when you see people hashtagging or posting videos on the internet uh, saying and showing that they participated in this event. And that's, that's the point. Instead of us all gathering in a town square and for all of us to be seen in unity that way, I hope we will take over the internet using the hashtag Be The Light October 22nd and TAV, T-A-V, hashtag T-A-V, uh, and hashtag 22. If people see this and they see it saturate the internet on the day after or the night of October 22nd, I think it will give people hope. I know it has already given me hope to know that so many of you are already participating in this. And I believe that when we have hope and we feel that people truly care about us and our needs and our wants and our desires, uh, that the world becomes a little bit of a brighter place. Hence the lighting of a candle at dark. So, um, 
yeah, I hope you guys will join me. I'm going to make this video very short so that way you guys can pass it on and it won't bore anybody. I want to thank everybody who participated in the pre uh, lighting candle ceremony on the 8th and I want to thank everybody who's going to be joining us on October 22nd and uh, For all the support and spreading the word because nobody would know about this if it wasn't for you guys Sharing these videos and these links when you do go to facebook.com forward slash Yeshua Official you will see an event page Please go ahead and go on there for more details to remind you what we're doing and why and uh, Hi squirrel my squirrel is comes to visit me my little friend here, so uh, thank you guys. Be blessed, be the blessing, and be the light on October 22nd with us as just a symbol of unity. The world's becoming dark, but we're going to be the light of the world. Amen? Thank you guys. Have a blessed day. Talk to you soon.